Hey Toku Faithful, it's uh, time for another edition of Ask the Rider. So this time I'm going to look for a non-Toku question, since the last one was sort of Toku related. But that's neither here nor there. Here's one from Toku Boy Studios. What slash who inspired you to start making videos, and how long does it take to make an episode of Toku Time? Well, that's actually two questions, but uh, I'll, uh, I'll let it slide just this once. But try to keep it to one question, otherwise I'm going to be here all week. What or who inspired me to make videos? Well, a lot of the things factored into me making uh, my own videos. Uh, I guess the first one was technically college. I majored in mass media, found out I had a knack for editing videos. I pretty much got straight A's in all my editing courses. So uh, that was a big deal of it. And um, well, around 2008 or 2009, after I left uh, for personal reasons, uh, I started watching um, other internet critics, Angry Video Game Nerd, Nostalgia Critic, a few others, and I thought, you know, I thought I'd try my hand at that, and so I started talking about tokusatsu, since I was a fan at the time, I was just getting into it, and I noticed that, one, not many people were talking about it, and two, everybody else was doing anime, so I thought I'd try something a little different, and the rest is history. Um... Uh, I'd say uh, they, uh, guys like um, ABGN, Nostalgia Critic, and Linkara definitely were an inspiration to me. Probably why I do the storyline in Toku Time. But uh, one of the biggest inspirations of all time, and if you know, know me on social media, if you follow my social media, any social media, you know one of my biggest inspirations, my mentor, uh, a person I idolize, is Joe Bob Briggs. Uh, I've been watching him since I was... Um, a teenager. I watched Monster Vision religiously, and I just loved his take on movies, and uh, just the way he would uh, deconstruct movies, uh, point out tidbits of trivia, little factoids, and throw in some humor. Uh, him and Mystery Science Theater definitely, definitely um, inspired my own brand of comedy and analysis on things I, I review. So, uh, those are the, that's probably the what and the who, but uh, yeah, that's, um, those are my inspirations. If you didn't know, now you do. Uh, how long does it take, and how long does it take a Toku Time video to get made? Well, honestly, there's no real set time. Honestly, it's, uh, a lot of it has to do with how long the series is. If it's uh, a short series, not too long, but if it's a 50 plus episode series, I have to watch every single episode Take notes on every episode. I would like to be thorough. There was a lot of times back in when I was just starting that I would just uh, breeze through it. And uh, I kind of regretted that. But anyway, uh, I like to be thorough. Kind of like uh, with the Ultra Spectacus now. I'm going episode to episode. You know, leaving uh, no stone unturned. And that eats up a lot of time. Because i got to pause the video, write down, write down the uh, what I see, uh uh, things that I noticed, uh, plot elements, uh, jokes, possible jokes, or, or running gags, or, or uh, skits I could do. And then I've got to whittle all that down into a script, uh, usually 10 or 11 pages long, if I'm lucky. And then, of course, I've got to uh, film that. Uh, that usually takes about a day and a half, unless I have to film something elsewhere outside the apartment, or do some other kind of skit, set, something, set up a, a green screen or a backdrop. Uh, then comes the worst part, the editing. That takes forever. Now, I, I don't mean to brag. I mean, I'm, I'm fairly good at editing, but it's very time consuming. It takes all day to get one effect done, if I'm lucky. But, and of course, um, if you followed me in the past, uh, past year, uh, that's, that's kind of led to a medical condition where I can't edit as much as I used to anymore. Basically, I was, um, I have a, a brain condition like here, and a lot of it had to do with me staring at a screen too long without blue blockers, so that really fried my brain. And looking at the flashing effects in Toku, where you're supposed to sit in a bright room away from this TV screen, didn't help. So, um, I've kind of slowed down on that, plus I'm reaching middle age, and being hunched over a computer all day is not doing my back and neck any favor. So, yeah, I, I don't edit as much as I use. It's kind of why I'm doing these videos right now, so I can just film them 
and go. Kind of like with Ultra Spectre because I'm not doing any live action bits because it's easier to just talk into a microphone, put the video clips over it and be done with it. It's kind of why I'm doing these uh, kind of videos now. They're easier to edit and easier to get out. But uh, I hope that answers your question. Uh, remember to use hashtag AskTheWriter when you're asking uh, your questions. Uh, I think I'll do a Toku question next time. And uh, keep them coming. Who knows? Maybe you'll be the next one. So until then, later.